so sick of me. Hi, hello, welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jess. Yes, um, if you had any questions, this is a pro Palestinian account. Palestine will be free, okay, from the river to the sea. Thank you. Um, I have links down below for you to learn if you haven't yet. I don't know what the fuck you're doing. We're 50 plus some days into this genocide of Palestinians. So I don't know what, why you still need to learn something, but maybe you do, it's down below. But also Sudan, Congo, there are, I forgot the count, is it six or eight ongoing genocides worldwide right now? So it's free Palestine, okay? It's free Hawaii, free Puerto Rico, free Tigre, free West Papua, free um, the Democratic Republic of Congo, free Sudan. It's free all people worldwide from these oppressive governments that we live under. Anyway, just thought you should know that. Okay, but I did come here to tell you something <laughs> and you probably saw that in the thumbnail. So uh, my nonfiction book club that took a hiatus this year um, because Mentally Unwell is coming back January 2024 it's time. I'm ready to get back in my nonfiction bag. Y'all need to get back in your nonfiction bag. And so in January, we're not voting. We are reading Freedom is a Constant Struggle by Angela Davis. This I think is a great um, way to start off the year, especially with, you know, the ongoing ethnic cleansing and genocide of Palestinian people. And this talks about Palestine, um, but it talks about, and it really explains, cause this will be a reread for me. And it's only about like 140, 145 pages. So very easy. And it's a collection of like Angela Davis's, is he like speeches or essays she's done in different places, like compiled. And so the audio is really great. It's narrated by her. And I think it's a, a great way to start your nonfiction reading year, but it's looking at how all of our struggles are intertwined. And that is including how Palestinians, and I think this is an important book for me to choose to start um, with bringing back the book club because I feel like there are a lot of people, especially in the United States, um, that think that this has nothing to do with them. You know, they're like, well, I don't know anyone over there. I'm not Palestinian. That has nothing to do with me, but it does. All worldwide struggles of all peoples are connected because what colonization, imperialism. And so freedom is a constant struggle. It also talks about um, like the, the prison complex and, and just does a really great way, again, in these different like speeches or essays that she writes to bring it all together, how it's all interconnected and that it is not something that we can just win and then be done and great, now we're all free. It's a constant, it's gonna be a constant battle because there's always gonna be people wanting to take freedom from other people below them. So anyway, um, if you never participated in the book club before, I will put it back in my description as a link. There's a discord that um, I have ghosted this entire year, but it's still there. And so there'll be a channel for the book where you can talk with people as you're reading it. And then we normally would do a discussion, a live stream on my channel the next month um, with Angela from Literature Science Alliance, who is my co-host. And then um, there may be other people or it could be just us. Now last year or the first, not last year, but the year before, it was every other month. So I was doing, it was, it was six books per year. And I'm, I don't know. I feel like we need to read one every month. So that the jury's still out, but we were voting beforehand. Um, but in January, we're just gonna start with this one and then I'll see what to do going forward. But anyway, all you have to do is read the book to participate. That's it, join the Discord if you want. Um, there was a Twitter, but I've deleted my Twitter and I'm trying to delete that one, but I can't figure out the password, but so don't follow that. But there is an Instagram and it has not been active, but I'm gonna get back on there. But the best way, if you wanna have ongoing discussions with people is to join the Discord. And then if you wanna talk in real time um, is to watch the live stream. And I'll always update here when that's going to be. But so for January, go ahead and get you a copy, get on, get on the uh, wait list at your library because right now it's probably a long hold for a book like Freedom is a Constant Struggle. Um, or, or purchase you a copy. I read an e, I think I read an ebook 
I have the ebook and I also listened to it the first time, but I think I want to get a physical copy and go back and through and like make notes and stuff this time. So I hope that you all join because, um, yeah, I, I don't want to say it's my job, but I feel like I have, I appreciate all of those who have supported me over the years to give me this platform at however many people it can reach. And I feel very, I feel very helpless, very powerless in this situation. Um, with what's going on in in Gaza and even in the occupied West Bank and so you know I'm doing what I can and I feel like this since obviously this is a book tube book club this is another way to help in some very 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 small way like it doesn't do anything to change everyone whose lives are being taken now but maybe in the future I don't know anyway not too much before i cry on camera that's gonna be it if you have any questions about the book club you can uh plop that down below let me know if you'll be joining us and i'll see you next time um stay moisturized hydrated sunscreen i don't remember what i i don't know goodbye